Hi, y'all. It's Mike. Um, I just come on here real quick. You know. I seen, uh, I'm not gonna say the channel's name, but I seen some person here on YouTube, like, trying to glorify what they're doing and all this stuff, um, I'm just coming to speak about that, but I am against that, because if you look at it, people, people are going to make, uh, people are going to make a mockery of you, and on top of that, people are going to make you feel like, oh, you're not, because you're not, like, you're not that, like, quote unquote famous. I'm not that popular, but you know what? Who cares about being popular? Because once you die and you go to heaven and you're not gonna be you're not gonna be popular over there either. So I don't get why people are like, oh I have to be popular, I have to know the most famous people and I'm gonna do and I'm like, are you for real? The main thing, the main deal should be that you're getting souls added to the kingdom of God. Not like saying, oh, I'm praying that I can get over uh, 400, 10,000 subscribers on YouTube. And oh, everybody ought to, you know, come over to my channel and blah, blah, blah. It's good to announce the people that you follow. But I don't do that for glorification. And I don't do that so people can, like make me an idol or make me a god say oh look what you're doing and all this crazy stuff like most of these people are doing on social uh on on here on youtube they're making themselves an idol and making people like worship them and stuff i feel like it's kind of like in a way it's kind of like brainwashing because you can't sit here and say oh well you know uh i shouldn't you know, I, I shouldn't post that or I shouldn't post this. Well, you know, folks, we're in a uh, world where we have the freedom to put whatever we want on social media or on any platform. But I will say that I personally um, am against people who do that. Um Maybe God has not convicted them. I know some people have different standards and etc. But I will say for myself, I'm not going to tell you or I'm not going to sit here and say, oh, don't follow that person because all oh, that person is this. That. Like, just because I don't believe exactly word for word what you believe in doesn't mean that I'm a bad person. I'm, I'm like a bad individual. But I will say is that be careful of these people who try to put themselves on a pedestal and like wanting to get all these certain numbers and oh I have to see how many people are liking my things on social media I gotta see and and I'm gonna be honest and real with you guys is that's why I really uh in a sense I do have social media platform I do have Oh, excuse me. <clears throat> I do have an Instagram. I do have a uh, a Pinterest. I do have a YouTube. Um, but I will say is that I'm not going on these platforms seeing how many people follow me, how many people like my posts, how many people get glorification out of what I'm doing because I don't want that in my life. Other people may. But Mike does not. So, you know, when I hear people do that, I'm like, okay, I got to click out. I got to go. I don't want to hear about how many people, what I really want to hear from people in the kingdom of God. How many souls are you winning for the cause of Christ? Not how many people you have, how, not how many followers you have on Instagram, how, not how many followers you have on uh, 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 YouTube and all this other, these other platforms. I don't want to hear that. I'm all about kingdom building, saving souls for the cause of Christ, seeing people get uh, filled with the Holy Ghost baptized and that's what I'm all about all that other stuff I can care less about people oh I'm going live tonight I'm doing this I'm doing that 
excuse me, I'm sorry to bust your bubble and I'm sorry to hurt your feelings, but I could care less about that. So I just say, whatever God's given to you, let it be used for the glory of God. We're not, we're not in a, um, we're, we're not in a, we're, we're not in a, what is it called? We're, we're not, we're not in a gang. We're not in a club. We're not like, oh yeah, let's have competition against this person. Let's do this. Let's do that. No, I ain't here for competition. I'm going to tell you, each and one of you right now, I'm not here for that. What I'm here for is be seeing so, uh, is to be seeing saved, souls saved. And that's the only thing that's important. All that other jazz is out the window because God looks at the uh, at the soul. He looks at how hungry these people are. You know, he's like, oh, I need the word, I need the word, I need the word, I need to get my Bible. I don't do my Bible reading. But you know the funny thing is, all these people want to talk about the uh, uh, receiving the Holy Ghost baptism in, in, in Jesus' name, baptize them in the Father, Son, the Holy Ghost, and then, but at the same token, your study on social media, posting day in, day out, every day, every hour, every few minutes, you're looking at your social media, turn that garbage off and really plug in, get connected with the Holy, with the Holy Spirit, with the Holy Ghost, get connected with that, because that's what's going to save your soul from a burning hell, lake of fire and damnation. I am so tired of my generation, people who are younger than me, say, oh, I can't read the Bible. I can't do this. I can't do that. Well, you know what? Prayer and fasting starts in your house. It don't start when you go to church. It don't start when you go to church on Sunday. It don't start when you go to church on, on Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, whenever, whatever day you go. People, we got to get back to the basis. Loving God, loving people, serving people, and going out there for the kingdom of God, for the cause of Christ. I am ready to see people really want to hunger for God, really want to thirst for Him. I am so tired of these young people saying, oh, well, you know, Mike, I just want to be popular. That's all I want in my life. I just want to be this know-it-all and show it off and do all this. Okay, do that on your own watch, but over here... What you see is what you're gonna get, and I'm not. I, I'm not backing down from no person. I don't care who you are. If you don't like this channel, go somewhere else. I could care less. But what Mike's all about, he's about seeing people get saved. He's about seeing people be filled with the Holy Ghost. He's about people. Um, if people walked away from God, getting renewed in the spirit. God says he is the God that can help people receive the favor, the baptism in the Holy Ghost, sanctification, edification, purity in the spirit. So what I come to say is the rest of this year, we're all about kingdom, kingdom work. If it don't have nothing to do with the kingdom of God, don't come to me. If it don't have nothing to do with kingdom work, don't tell me. If it don't have anything to do with Bible, B-L-B-L-E, the Holy, B-I-B-L-E, the Bible, the Holy Bible, the King James Version, 1116. If it don't have nothing to do with that, I don't want to hear it. And I'm being real, I'm being honest to the truth. I don't want to hear it. I don't want to hear how many people you got on Instagram, how many people you got on uh, 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 YouTube. I don't want to hear how many people you got on Pinterest. It's time we get real and get down to the nitty gritty of serving God. I'm tired of these people want to put on a show, put on a front for people. I don't got to do that for people. I love God. God loves me. And this is where we got to go. If you say you're a minister, you need to minister the word. If you say you're a pastor, be a pastor. If you say you're a musician, be the musician. But don't sit here and say how many people you got and how what you're doing and all this other stuff. 
All that stuff is in vain and it's vanity. I'm telling you the word. We got to pray for these young people. That they will really, I don't care what denomination you're part of, that you will really catch on fire. Burn in the Holy Ghost. Burn with passion. Burn with understanding. Want to see people saved. That's why I be telling people when I go out and about, it, it's about the Father's business. I'm all about the Father's business. Seeing people get saved, sanctified, filled with the Holy Ghost, with, 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 with sanctification, with, with edification, with purification. All those things that God wants. He wants a clean heart. He don't want some person to say, oh, look what I can do. I can do that better than you can. Okay, friend. God says, he has come to the world. He that knew no sin cast the first stone. We got to be lovers to one another. We can't say we love God, but we can't, we can't love our neighbor. We can't say we love God. We say, oh, I love God, but oh, just because we don't agree on the same doctrine, we got to fall out. We got to fight. We got to say, we got to text people, say, oh, I'm, I'm on my way to your house. I'm, I'm doing this. I'm doing that. No, you don't need to do that. We both love God. We're serving God in the capacity that God wants us to do. And when God wants to do what God wants to do with each each one of us, he will do that. But it's not because we got to get be up on here on these social media platforms saying how much we, what we're doing so we can get some glorification. So I encourage you guys, plug in, plug into the word. If you don't like, maybe like myself. I do podcasts. I listen to podcasts. I listen to podcasts. I write the scripture down, look it up, uh, look up the look up the um, commentary and things like that. That's how you can grow in your faith. People say, "Oh, you got to actually sit down and read the Bible." Some people do like to actually sit down and read the Bible, turn the pages of it. I turn the pages of it after I listen to my podcast. Whoever is ministering, but during that time, no. I don't sit there and say, oh, he ain't preaching right. Or, oh, she not preaching the Bible. Or, oh, he ain't preaching the word. I don't care if you disagree with me, but I do believe that women are called by God to be used of God. So, I want to encourage somebody this week. I don't care where you go. Remember this. It's all about kingdom work. Kingdom building. Building souls for the kingdom of God. It's not about how many numbers we get. So, hopefully you guys have a blessed night. And I'll talk to you on the next vlog. Bye.